Naturally active and alert, sporting dogs make likable, well-rounded companions. First developed to work closely with hunters to locate and slash or retrieve quarry. There are four basic types of sporting dogs, spaniels, pointers, retrievers, and setters. Known for their superior instincts in water and woods, many of these breeds enjoy hunting and other field activities. Many of them, especially the water retrieving breeds, have well insulated water repellent coats, which are quite resilient to the elements. Thinking of getting one, just realize that most require regular, invigorating exercise. First of all, join our community of dog lovers. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe channel to start videos. Hello and welcome to our channel. We are here again to talk about sport breeds. It is about the Barbet breed, an archetypic water dog of France. The Barbet is a rustic breed of medium size and balanced proportions that appears in artwork as early as the 16th century. In profile, the Barbet is slightly rectangular with a substantial head and long, sweeping tail. It has a long, dense covering of curly hair and a distinctive beard. An agile athlete, the barbit has been used primarily to locate, flush, and retrieve birds. He has a cheerful disposition and is very social and loyal. The defining characteristic of this rustic, medium-sized bird dog is the dense curly coat that covers him from the top of his large, broad head to the tip of his curving tail. The coat comes in shades of black, gray, brown, or fawn, sometimes with white markings. The breed's delightfully shaggy coat and amiable nature create the impression a puppet come to life. But the Barbet is a strong, solidly built dog bred for centuries to be a keen hunter and tireless swimmer. Barbets are very intelligent and learn new things quickly. They have a calm nature and are easy to live with as long as their exercise needs are being met. Training A barbit requires consistency, positive reinforcement, and early socialization. Start training your barbit puppy early to establish good behavior habits and use positive reinforcement techniques like treats and praise. Be consistent with commands and expectations, teaching them basic obedience commands and providing mental stimulation through interactive toys and varied environments. Leash and potty training should be a focus, gradually introducing distractions and establishing a routine. Consider advanced activities like agility or obedience trials as your barbit progresses. Patience, persistence, and a positive attitude are essential throughout the training process, and adapting methods to their individual needs is important. Seek professional guidance if needed, and with time and effort, your barbit will become a well-behaved and obedient companion. Health The barbit is generally considered a healthy breed, but like all dogs, they are susceptible to certain health issues. Here are some common health concerns that can affect barbits. Hip dysplasia This is a genetic condition where the hip joint doesn't develop properly. It can lead to discomfort, lameness, and arthritis. Responsible breeders perform hip evaluations on their breeding stock to help minimize the risk of hip dysplasia. Progressive retinal atrophy pra. PR is an inherited degenerative eye disease that leads to progressive vision loss and can eventually result in blindness. Regular eye examinations by a veterinary ophthalmologist are recommended to detect and manage PR. Hypothyroidism This condition occurs when the thyroid gland doesn't produce enough hormones, leading to various symptoms like weight gain, lethargy, and skin issues. Regular thyroid function tests can help diagnose and manage hypothyroidism. Ear infections. 
due to their floppy ears and dense hair. Barbits are prone to ear infections. Regular ear cleaning and proper grooming practices can help prevent these infections. Allergies Barbits can develop allergies, including food allergies, environmental allergies, and skin allergies. Identifying and avoiding triggers, along with appropriate veterinary care, can help manage allergic reactions. It's essential to choose a reputable breeder who prioritizes health testing and proper breeding practices to minimize the risk of these health issues. Regular veterinary checkups, a balanced diet, regular exercise, and proper grooming can also contribute to maintaining your barbit's overall health and well-being. If you have concerns about your barbit's health or notice any unusual symptoms, it's best to consult with a veterinarian for an accurate diagnosis and appropriate treatment. Diet Feeding a barbit a balanced and appropriate diet is essential for their overall health and well-being. Start by choosing a high-quality commercial dog food that is specifically formulated for medium to large-sized breeds. Look for a product that lists the high-quality source of protein as the main ingredient. Avoid foods with excessive fillers, artificial additives, or low-quality meat byproducts. It's important to adjust their diet according to their life stage. Providing puppy-specific formulas during their growth phase and transitioning to adult formulas as they mature. Senior barbits may require diets tailored to their specific needs, such as lower calorie content or joint support. Ensure portion control by establishing a regular feeding schedule and measuring the appropriate portion size based on age, weight, and activity level. Avoid overfeeding to prevent obesity, which can lead to health issues. While treats can be used for training and rewards, it's important to use them in moderation to avoid excessive calorie intake. Provide fresh and clean water at all times to keep your barbit well hydrated. Socialization Socialization is a crucial aspect of raising a barbit puppy and should begin as early as possible. During the critical socialization period, which typically occurs between 3 to 14 weeks of age, expose your barbit to a wide range of people, animals, and environments. Introduce them to different sights, sounds, and experiences in a positive and controlled manner. Take them to various places such as parks, busy streets, and pet-friendly establishments. Encourage positive interactions with well-behaved dogs and individuals of different ages, sizes, and backgrounds. Puppy socialization classes can also provide valuable opportunities for your barbit to interact and play with other puppies under the supervision of a professional trainer. In conclusion, the Barbit Breed is a wonderful choice for dog enthusiasts seeking a loyal, intelligent, and adaptable companion. With their unique and beautiful curly coat, they bring a touch of charm to any home. Barbits thrive on human interaction and form strong bonds with their owners, making them ideal family pets. Despite their grooming needs, they are low shedding, making them suitable for individuals with allergies. Their friendly and outgoing nature, coupled with their willingness to please, makes them a joy to train and socialize. Whether participating in activities or simply enjoying quality time with their loved ones, Barbits bring happiness and companionship to those fortunate enough to have them as part of their lives. The Barbit breed is sure to captivate viewers and bring joy to all who follow their adventures on the YouTube channel. So, what are your thoughts? Do you believe that Barbit breed can be a perfect pet for your home? Why? Or why not? Comment down your thoughts below. As always, if you enjoyed today's content, make sure to like, share, and subscribe channel to be updated with our latest videos. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. Once again, this is Paul I. Fact. Thanks for watching, and we can't wait to see you in our next video.